Over the last one year, the cost of power has been a major concern for most Kenyans, with the country almost unable to meet its power demand. The fuel adjustment cost has been a key concern, with Kenyans paying as much as 9 shillings per unit. Other costs include forex adjustment and infrastructure costs. The infrastructure cost is mostly used to pay loans by both Kenya Power and power generators such as Kenjan and independent power producers. Most of the cost is incurred when developing power stations and drilling for geothermal wells. With new technology, however, this cost is set to drastically reduce as power generating companies switch from diesel power generators to use drilled wells to generate electricity from already developed geothermal wells. We'll just hook up the rigs to the wellheads and this will be very cheap electricity. That means very cheap well and that means at the end very cheap electricity. In addition to cutting on the cost of drilling, Kenjan says it will sink deeper wells to produce more power. The current wells are at a depth of 1,000 meters, produce an average of 3.5 megawatts per well, compared to deeper wells that can produce an average of 7.5 megawatts per well. You require half the wells to produce the same amount of, uh, of, of power. That automatically is very cheap. But also we have found that with the drilling deep we can get very, very big wells. Kenzen plans to put up a new 540 megawatt plant by 2018. The company expects to bring online 280 megawatts by 2014, having drilled most of the wells needed to generate the additional capacity. Henry Gedaiga, Citizen Business.